Hey, welcome to another episode of Wix Fundamentals for the Wix user. Tonight we're going to go over adding your uh, Google Analytics code to your Wix website. So this video is going to assume that you've already created a Google Analytics uh, account with uh, Google. Very simple to do. Um, once you get that account set up, then we can start rolling on getting your analytics uh, code onto your website. So the first thing we need to do is go to our dashboard in our um, Google Analytics. So analytics.google.com is your way to log into your analytics uh, account. And there are a couple different ways to get your Google Analytics code. The easiest one to do is just go to all accounts and find your website. So find your account. So if you're doing multiple Websites, just make sure you use the correct analytics code. So here is, for my site, right there is my analytics code. This one you really, you can't copy and paste, but it's really not that hard to, to remember that number. So what we're going to do is we're going to take that number and go into our editor. So now we're into our editor. We go to settings. Tracking and analytics. So here's where we can add our analytics code. If we have Google Ads, the Facebook pixel like we did on the on a previous video, and we want to add a new tool. Now, of course, Google Analytics for me is grayed out because I already have it in there. So we'll just go to the edit so you have an idea what it is. And right here is where we put in our analytics code. Remember the UA and the dash one. That's a uh, Good thing to remember that makes it your your full code. IP uh, anonymization. Um, it's for visitors. Uh, confidentiality. Google will never save their complete IP addresses. It's up to you if you click this or not. Sometimes uh, the added stuff just sometimes can slow things down. So I just don't don't click it. It's really up to you. Um, hit the apply button. And now um, we're going to publish our site. Always make sure to publish after you add the uh, analytics code. And now we want to test to make sure that that code is working. So we're going to go to um, our Google extensions and we're going to download the Tag Assistant. Tag Assistant is this nice little um, code, a little logo on the top here. The easiest thing to do then is to go to our website and if there's a code there this will show up this will uh, will light up you can see all the different Google tags that are associated with this website so I have a Google Ads tag I have a Google Analytics and a Google Optimize tag so now I know that the Google a Analytics is working it's a quick simple way to add Google Analytics to your your website the next video is going to go over another way of tracking uh, your your visitors something i find a little bit easier than using google analytics it's not as technical make sure to like this video share it with your 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 wix friends don't hesitate to email me with any questions and also make sure to check out our facebook page have a great night. Great night.